Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Recently I did a video on Shiso, also known as Purple Perella, and many people have expressed interest in finding out where to get the seeds. So there are many places online that would offer seeds and uh, you can probably check Amazon, they usually have stuff like this or just do a Google search. But um, I will show you another way to get these seeds without having to spend a lot of money. All you have to do is visit your local Asian supermarket and if you live in Houston there's a huge supermarket uh, on Bel Air called Hong Kong supermarket and this is where I got it. You can get this for a dollar a bundle look how much of these leaves you get for just one dollar and you can actually use these to propagate and grow into a new plant so that you don't have to spend money on buying seeds. So let me show you how to do that. Of course you would need uh, some shiso plants that uh, you purchase and when you buy them make sure they're nice and uh, fresh and that some of them will have a nice branch like this. Uh, don't buy the one with just leaves only so buy something that is nice and fresh and firm and nothing is shriveled up yet and it's still nice and plump so those are the kind that you would uh, need to look for so first is a plant and then the next is all you need is a, just a plain uh, container any kind and uh, you can use recycled water bottle if you like um, I have a bunch of this that I recycle so I'm gonna use this all you have to do is cut these out okay and then we're gonna get some water just right out of your faucet so to around right here so let's get the water real quick Alright, so here it is, the water is filled, so what we're going to do next is prepare this plant to uh, be placed in the water. And uh, what I recommend is that you strip everything from the bottom here, because that part is going to go in water, so you don't need anything there. You want that part to root, and then you want to cut all of the larger leaves off, because uh, that would help promote rooting faster. And uh, you can, if you are doing this for seeds, just leave the tip. And if you are not and you just want nice plants to grow with a bunch of leaves, you can uh, chop it right here. But uh, for the purpose of this video, for those that want seeds, this is what we're going to do. So what you're going to do next is you're going to trim this part off right here, the dry area, just uh, a 45 degree angle like that so that it can have a way to uh, soak up water to keep itself alive. And then we're going to put that right in there. and. Uh, you always want to do more than one just so that you can secure some success and not waste time. So these are so inexpensive, I'm just going to do a bunch more and I'm using these leaves anyway. Okay, and then uh, we'll just cut this part out. And then we'll leave it in here. Alright, so we have three nice uh, cuttings there. So what we're going to do is we're going to place this by a bright window. So you need a spot where it can get some sun. It doesn't have to be uh, sun all day, but a little bit of sun will work just fine. Or if you have a shaded place outside that will have a good amount of lights, that will work as well. Uh, if you put this on a counter on your kitchen, it may not work because the, the lights there is not strong enough. So let me show you where I'm going to put it. Okay, there's my window there. Uh, this spot here gets uh, a good amount of sunlight for a few hours and then the rest of the time is very, very bright. So I'm going to leave that there and we will come back once it's rooted and then I will show you. Okay guys, today has been exactly five days and I have some progress on the plants. So we'll move over here and I'll show you what's going on. Let me show you some roots here. Check that out. So in five days, you can get these to root, and then you wait a few more days and you can plant this in, in soil. And these will uh, grow very nice and well and fast, so that in very little time, you're gonna have a lot more of these plants to use. So that is another way that is really cheap to uh, get some of these in your garden. So um, I hope you guys liked the video. If you have any questions or comments, Please leave it below and thank you so much for watching.